Welcome back. We're still playing. Yeah, welcome back to Kirby's Dream Course, and uh, welcome back to On The Links. And I guess I should probably finish the story I was telling from last episode. Oh, yeah. Was that... And you do go first, so there's that for you. So, I barely ever rode the bus, but when I did, I didn't really... I never really specified whether it was, like, front or back. I just kind of sat where... The thing for me was I wanted a seat of my own. Ah, uh, yes. So, like... I would do everything in my power to get on the bus as like early as I could and load it up with like backpacks or duffel bags and shit so that nobody would ever like, oh man, his seat is just so full, you know, he's a cool guy, but I couldn't possibly fit there. And it was like, haha, fuck you, this is all mine. Because I like, did you, you did some sports in high school, right? I did a lot of sports in high school, yeah. Oh yeah, right, you did lacrosse. So like, because the best thing for me was like after, because I did cross country and like some track, but that was a mistake. God, oh! Well, fuck you too then. Thanks, I'll take my spikes back. <laughs> um, after like a meet. Oh, wait, or you're, anything, you're asleep. You're uh, sleeping. Um, the best thing was like, because you were exhausted and you were sweaty and you didn't want to like sit next to someone else's exhausted and sweatiness. Ah, uh, yeah. So the best thing was to like, get that bus seat on your own and then just like lay out in the aisle and just pass out. Oh, it yeah. It was the best. So, that was my goal every single bus ride, was to somehow get a seat of my own so I could just sleep the entire way back. Yeah, I think that's a... that, that is an admirable goal. Mm-hmm. As far as bus rides go. I, th I think I actually strayed away from the back of the bus because all the kids that I didn't like were back there. And I, it was annoying. Yeah, it's weird, like... So it sort of depended on... Oh, wait, I wanted the spikes still. Damn it. Too fucking bad. Oh, now I'm at a wheel. All right, fuck it. Okay. <laughs> Stay up there. Stay up there. Uh oh Yeah, daddy. Um, so... For, like, a lot of sports, I didn't sit in the back of the bus. Uh, because the back of the bus was, like, where the, the scary kids sat. Exactly. And I don't mean scary, like, oh, they're, they're terrifying, but, like... They were into weird things, and, and it just, it was, like, not weird, like, weird, but I don't know what I'm trying to say They're giving each other, like, prison tattoos. Yeah, that. yeah, the, like, sketchy kind of weird. Oh, yeah. Um, because we're yes. both from, yes. oh. uh, we're both from real, like, country bumpkin sort of hometowns. Oh, yeah. And so, like, all the fake rednecks and stuff sat in the back of the bus, mm -hmm. uh, as, as far as sports went. Um, but then, like... For, uh, for, for everyday living, um, I, I pretty much sat near the front of the bus, I guess, most of the time. Oh, how do I want to do this? I should have thought farther ahead. I don't know if that was what I wanted. Nope. Nope. Fuck it. <laughs> when in doubt. <laughs> well, I guess now you just go I back to where you spawn over there, yeah. yeah. Um... Yeah, the bus was a really dark place growing up. Like, <laughs> bad things happened on the bus. Please tell me that you have, like, emo diary entries of, like, today on the back of the bus. I guess they just... You know, They I... don't understand me. <laughs> Fuck, I just went in there! Was... Was I, like, a quiet emo kid at points in my life? Yes, absolutely. <laughs> but I was never the diary type. Like, that was never really a thing. Well, hold on. First, let me correct myself. It's not a diary, it's a journal. Yeah, but still. God. Like... <laughs> Mom! Um, yeah, it was never really... Like, I don't know. I just... I never really liked to write my feelings down. Uh, um, I wrote some songs, though, and I'm not really proud of a lot of those. Yeah. But, um... Oh god, I remember when I first started writing music. Yeah, right? Ugh. It's how you get all your emotions out. It really was. Um, but the... Oh god. Like, the school bus was just strange. Weird things happened on the bus. People got pregnant on the bus. Indeed. Um, it was just... It's a dirty area. Straight up. Oh, oh no. good. Yes! <gasps> That's bullshit! Yes. That's bullshit. Oh, uh, it's okay. We're both sleeping, so it'll still go to me. Because I'll get unsleepy first. So I'll sleep some, and then you'll get dropped off, and you can sleep some. And then it'll come back to me, and I'll be awake, and I can go and take those away from you. And it'll be great. Um, I wish there was a way to change the vantage point. That is my one major complaint with Kirby's Dream Course, is that oh, I can't... like, rotate the camera I can't around. shoot from behind Kirby. Oh... 
it. Get over that lip. Get over that lip. <laughs> oh, you actually... Fuck. You actually did it. And you have all the stars? Are you kidding me? Get over there. <laughs> get over there. Oh, no. get in there. No. Get it. Get it. Get it. Get it. Oh! Uh -huh. Oh, man! <laughs> oh, I want it so bad. <laughs> oh, I just want it. <sighs> I just want it. I mean, you're gonna get it on the next shot. So are you gonna go steal my shit? I can at least go down in some kind of blaze of glory. Yeah, I mean, if you want to call it that. Or I can just fucking take this from you so you can't get the satisfaction of sinking it. You right. It. It'd be a shame if you overshot it. Oh. And knocked me in! No. Oh. Oh! Well, oh. get around me now, Oh, bitch. that's some dickery. <laughs> some straight dickishness. Alright, there's only one thing we can't do. And that is to aim for this corner and hit it absolutely as hard as we can. Do you still- oh, you don't have the wheel anymore. No, nor do I have the tornado, because you took it from me That's true. when you bumped me. Oh. Get it, get it, No. Nope. damn it. Alright, well, there you go, you can- oh, wait, oh, I got the tornado back! Oh, oh, I didn't have time to press the button. Love tapped me. Yeah, apparently. I was really looking forward to the sweep. I think that means you go first. That, I'm pretty yeah. sure it's whoever whoever wins. Whoever the sinks the hole. Indeed. Way you go. Man, I am still just beating your ass. Oh god, I can feel it. Yes, <laughs> it's me beating your ass. And you left the lube. Oh. Oh. Well, you're you're beat. The, why why did I need lube to beat your ass? You're nice enough to. <laughs> I don't know where I'm going with that. I took a drink at the poorest time. <laughs> the the absolute poorest time. You should know this by now. I st oh. Hi, Star. I have anyway. never... Like, when I think of beating someone's ass, mm -hmm. I, I imagine smacking it. And I've never needed to lube... I've never needed to lube up for a smack. Were you ever spanked as a kid? Uh, one time. One and time? It, it will it will go down as infam in infamy as, like... The reason that I will never fuck with my father again. Really? Yeah. Okay, so what happened? Because there's clearly a story there. Okay, well, I'm gonna I'm gonna take this guy, and then I will tell the story. Um, and that one. Spaceship. Oh, shit. Oh. 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 That did a lot. Yeah, that... Okay. Um, so... So, like, I didn't get along super great with my mom as a kid. Mm-hmm. Um... I mean, I didn't get along super great with anybody as a kid, because I was just <laughs> angsty and no one understood me, but... <laughs> Especially your mom. God. Yeah, exactly. Um, so, I... We were supposed to go on some family bike trip or some shit like that. I don't know. Um, did your family ever go to a bike path? With, yeah, like, yeah. You we know, just one. ride bikes and whatever the hell. Um, so I was supposed to go on this family bike trip, yeah, and... I didn't wanna. That's <laughs> shocker. I just didn't wanna spend time with my family, and you know, did just it, I wasn't into it for whatever reason. Uh, which let me clarify, that's that's not at all like who I am now. Like, oh, oh, I thought I was facing the other way. I thought I was facing the other way. But why, Kirby? How great, how, Kirby? How much darker would it make this game if at the end of every fall there was just a tiny little like. <laughs> or like a... <laughs> <laughs> and we're just gonna fly right off this. Um... Whee! Oh, hit it. Oh, get out of there. Oh. Okay, good. Um, wait, wait. So... Wait. Oh, it <laughs> <laughs> Um... Oh, I'm sleeping. But I think you're also sleeping. Am I? Yeah, I don't know. It's we'll fine. see when you respawn. You're not dizzy. <laughs> Yeah, you, no, 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 no. I'm no. just real close to it. Um, so I didn't want to go for whatever reason, and I just basically told my parents that, like, yeah, I'm not going. I don't want to go on your stupid bike trip. Fuck. Whatever. Yeah, get back here. Damn it. That's what I thought. Um, I don't want to go on your stupid bike trip. I don't want to do your stupid family things. It's dumb. Whatever. Oh, can I not even get up there? Like, is it... Am I too close to the wall? I am! <laughs> Ball sack. No, because you're still facing... No, try it try now. Because you're... Yeah, no, I'm literally... No matter what direction I turn, uh, I go back that way. Oh. That's a fucking bummer, man. Bad. 
just an absolute fucking bummer. That's okay. I'm just gonna go this way. And add a little bit of this to the, the mixture. Um, so, I told my dad, yeah, I don't want to go. Like, mm -hmm. this is, this is dumb. I, I'm not interested. Like, I'm staying home. Mm -hmm. And my dad was like, or I think it was my mom who was like, no, you are going to go. Like, we're doing this as a family, so you're going to be there. And I basically said, hell no. Mm -hmm. um, and my dad was like, you're going. Go put your stuff in the car. Ooh. And I was like, don't tell me what to do. <laughs> uh, which was a grand mistake. Yep. Because my dad didn't tell me what to do. He grabbed me by my shoulders, bent me over his knee, and beat my sorry ass oh, yes. was into it, submission. Was it with a hand or was it with a paddle? It was just a hand. Ooh, yes. Um, and Classic. So... He, my parents have never hit me. Like there is never, they weren't a physical discipline family, and a a major chunk of that was because I have always been bigger than my parents. Like my dad is five eight on a good day. My mom is five six. They may, you know, both be of of mid weight. I don't really know what the cutoff is, but well, thanks. Oh uh, um, God. So. Well. Yeah. Um. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, good. Um, so, he, he bent me over and spanked the ever-living shit out of me and was like, you won't disrespect your mother like that. Like, Ooh. you won't disrespect your parents like that. And it was in front of the open glass door of our, like, house. Ooh. And I will never forget looking, like, out into the street and seeing people walk by as I had, like, tears streaming <laughs> down my face as, like, a 13-year-old boy because my dad spanks really hard. And I'm like, uh, I'm so, uh, And suddenly everything goes... Uh, and so, then, don't say it. Suddenly everything goes slow motion. Requiem for a Dream plays in the background. <laughs> Pretty much. It's like, literally somebody walking by, if they would have seen that scene in a commercial, just would have heard Sarah Laughlin in the background. Like, in the arms of an angel. Suddenly you get pennies at your door from donors. Um, and I, I, like, I remember the red umbrella that my family has just always had being opened by the door mm -hmm. because that image is so forever ingrained into my brain. <laughs> it was like, you know, like you take exposure on a camera mm -hmm. and when the shutter opens, it like burns in. Oh, yeah. It was like every time my dad hit my ass, the shutter opened it was more. one other picture burned into your history. Um, and so then I ran back into my room and I cried a whole bunch and then they were like, my dad came and knocked on my door. He's like, it's time to leave. And I got in the car and we went on a bike trip. Um, <laughs> and that is the only time I've ever been spanked and oh, I hated it. Classic and, 90s parenting. Yeah. Um, and like, you know, my parents, they were always like, oh, well, we'll take your privileges away or this, that, or the other thing. And But no, they, they hit me one time and I have not really fucked with my dad since. Well, you clearly learned your lesson. Yeah, but it's I... been two courses, so, uh... Sweet! Yeah, we'll see you next time on The Links. Bye.